Overconfidence bias. Confidence is good, but overconfidence is bad. Overconfidence makes a person misjudge his beliefs and opinions about any situation as compared to his actual worth. Thus, overconfidence bias is a bias which can lead a person into trouble just because he overestimated his understanding and ability to handle a situation. It is miscalibration of subjective probabilities in any situation. Overconfidence has been defined in three distinct ways. Overestimation of one's actual performance, overplacement of one's performance relative to others, and overposition of beliefs. Overconfidence bias can bring an investor into huge losses. Who's an overconfident person? An overconfident person does not accept competition and believes firmly that he or she is the best. He will believe they are the most skilled individuals and no one can defeat them. On the other hand, a self-confident person is aware about his skills and knows that he is going to give their best. Those with overconfidence have trouble accepting criticism. These people take illogical risks. From the investor's perspective, overconfidence bias can be classified into two types. One is prediction overconfidence. In this case, investor assigns a lower and a higher range too narrow without considering the historical trend of volatility. This leads to underestimating downside risk of their portfolio. Second is certainty overconfidence. In this, investor is too much confident about his prediction so he is 100% sure about the outcome. This leads to having a non-diversified portfolio. Few examples of overconfident people who are overconfident generally avoid asking route while driving as well as they will neither use any map. A student who is overconfident that he is going to get admission into Harvard University and applies only in Harvard University, it may happen that he may not get admission anywhere. A person can be overconfident about his memory and does not study for exams, can fail an exam due to lack of preparation. A person who is a good boxer and assumes that he is the best so did not prepare as per opponent's move may get defeated. Related biases and terms Overestimation It is overestimation of one's ability, performance and chances of success in any situation. Illusion of control It makes people overestimate their power of control they have in any given situation. Planning fallacy It explains that people overestimate their rate of completing a work or underestimate their speed of completing a task. Contrary evidence, also known as wishful thinking effects, wherein one can overestimate the likelihood of an outcome but the chances are relatively rare. Over precision, it is showing 100% confidence about knowing the outcome. Over placement, it makes you judge that your performance is better than others also known as better than average effect. Comparative optimism effects. In this case, people tend to believe that good things happen to them and bad things are less likely to happen to them as compared to others. How investors are affected by overconfidence bias. Overconfident investors can ignore downside risk of their investment as they give lesser prediction window they may believe that their investment portfolio choice is the best one and they can end up excess trading or earning poor returns. They may be overconfident about their ability to evaluate a company and may ignore negative information about a company. These investors may not diversify their portfolio and are also taking high risk in the market. These investors bo borrow money to buy stocks they may buy correlated investments. 
these investors are difficult to be convinced by their investment advisors. How to avoid investment mistakes? Always develop an investment plan before you invest. Make future decisions based on your personal financial goals. Develop a disciplined process to evaluate the level of risk and returns expected. One must listen to expert opinions in the market. Use stop losses. A saying in financial market says, one should not trade with money you cannot afford to lose. That's the key.